hello everyone in last tutorial what we have done is we have created a text file with the help of uh, uh, in json module in python right now i'm going to uh, the data uh, in that file is in the form of string now i'm, I'm going to read that particular data uh, in a very easily manner so first of all for that i'm going to create a particular variable f and i'm going to open that file last time we have stored it in d drive so d drive uh, the name was data dot txt right uh, after that uh, i need to mention which mode i want to open let's say i want to open in read mode right now i have to mention it right now i let me declare another variable s f dot read i am function going i am read function i am going to call after that i need to import json right and uh, in that further let's say i have uh, some person name value in which I'm going to put JSON dot loads because it's a string, right? Do you remember last time I printed the value of S, right? So now if I print person, right? Person, so it is going to list down all the values. See, now if you want to specifically want to print something, right? So in that case, what you can do is, let's say, you want to print the detail of person for Shiraz, for example, uh, print person, let's say Shiraz, right? So it will list down the details of only Shiraz, not, not for Leo, right? Oh, just a minute. I messed with bracket. Okay, so now if you want a specific field in the Shiraz, right, let's in the name Shiraz, let's say uh, you want to specify email underscore ID. So it will just print email under email ID of Shiraz, not for Leo, right? Let me execute. See, this is how it works. You can easily read uh, already existing uh, JSON file into the uh, idle as well for example i have already uh, let me create another python shell right in this case what i need to do is i need to import json after that i need to mention with open <clears throat> here i need to specify the path for example i have a json file at d drive right d drive python Sir, size kit dot json. Now I want to read this. I need to specify as let's say json underscore data, right? So now after that I need to mention let's say d equal json dot load json underscore data now if i want to print d right so let me show you the file which is already in uh, this python dot exercise can you see that uh, here kit is there in which a uh, dictionary is there it's a json file right uh, you can easily see the extension over here right so now I'm going to print this. See, it's now printed. So you can easily print text file, JSON file, or any other file, right? So thing is, this is how it works. Well, thank you for this tutorial.